Good day friends, welcome back to this new video. For filmmakers, B-rolls are fundamental to make a video much more cinematic and dynamic, but sometimes it is hard for people who have shaky hands. So we are using a slider to make a video smoother and more stabilized. And here we are going to talk about this budget-friendly carbon slider and what we can expect from it after the intro. Let's go! Well, this slider isn't as big and long as the high-end sliders, but with 40 cm it is definitely not a bad deal to make easy pans. And I'm especially impressed with the workmanship because this carbon slider feels really sturdy and it doesn't make any sign of easily breaking into two pieces. Weighing only 600 grams, the Zacti slider is also very handy. Additionally, as a budget slider, I was really surprised that it came with a bag, making it easy to carry around. Taking a closer look at this slider, we can see it has four adjustable feet covered with rubber, which helps the slider stay stable on slippery surfaces. This makes it possible to shoot not only indoors, but also outdoors for smooth and cinematic b-rolls. You can also screw the slider onto a tripod, allowing you to capture pan shots horizontally or vertically. However, I've noticed that you need a sturdier tripod to handle the weight of both the camera and the slider effectively. Once you use a stable tripod, it's really enjoyable to shoot with this slider. However, it's essential to note that you can only achieve sliding static shots. You can't follow the object while sliding and filming. In this case, I would recommend using a ball head from Ando, which is really reliable and performs well. But yeah, let's take a look at some footage captured with this slider. Alrighty, now I can say this slider priced around $60 is a perfect beginner slider for anyone who is just starting with filmmaking. The carbon material and the ability to achieve smooth pans make it a high quality budget slider. Although it's relatively short at only 40 cm, it's suitable for beginners making reviews or product videos. Well, my question now, do you use a slider? If yes, which one? Let me know in the comments and yeah, I would like to know about it. In addition, this video was a sponsor, so as always, I would appreciate it if you like and subscribe this channel for the upcoming videos. It's all for free. So, well, it's time to say goodbye. Thanks a lot and see you next time. Bye-bye.